Hello friend welcome back on Saexpo I am Dr Ravindra Dunde in today's video I am going to show you how to analyze population generating using popgen software this video will show you a co dominant haploid data analysis by using popgen so, so any further ado let's get let's get start if you not yet subscribe Saexpo do subscribe Saexpo you will get similar videos and actual data analysis training in future So co-dominant haploid data analysis. These are the basic uh, data file formats using for the, the co-dominant haploid data analysis. This is a single alphabetical uh, haploid data sheets. And uh, remember that if you have missing value in the in the haploid data, you will give give single dot. For for example, uh, deployed data set, you have to give double digit here. And for the heterozygous uh, condition, you have to give separate code for each each uh, each uh, different uh, heterozygous combinations see i here given the i have given I. so each different heterozygous combination you have to give different alphabetical uh, combination unique combination so that you have to count this allele as a different allele see i have given here here h combination i combinations and yes also i have given different code you have to give different code which is unique for each different heterozygous combinations of alleles so this is about the uh, total in this uh, population this uh, number of populations are four point types of population number of loci is 19 and these are the locus names and these are the original genotypes okay so next for haploid data analysis will see the number of parameters like gene frequency allele number effective allele number polymorphic loci gene diversity shannon index homogeneity genity test f statistic gene flow gen genetic distance dendrogram populations utility test two locus ld populations so on now let's jump into the excel file format for more detail and the practical uh, practical preparation of the demo input file format and analysis of this is a co-dominant haploid data analysis on excel file formats first four lines are the information about your data and the total number of uh, populations here uh, four five types of population number of loci is 19 and these are locus name and these are the your data haploid data analysis so i for the uh, understanding purpose i given different color for each population red one represent population one and then blue one represent population two and then purple represent population three black one represent four then orange one represent five so total number of five number of populations i remember that so here I am missing value I give one single dot because of this haploid data analysis and for example if you use deployed deploy data you have to give double digit here for that purpose you have to read the man user manual guide for popgen software and uh, different unique uh, allele like for example heterozygous unique allele for example AT AT is a heterozygous one so you have to give different code for each heterozygous combination present in your data file here i given g specific uh, combination here i i have given s also and g h a different combination as per your uh, specific uh, data types so these are the haploid data set and now i am going to copy all data file format from excel to the excel to the popgen software so this is the popgen software now i am create a new popgen file format click on new and i am paste going to paste here these are the text editor of popgen software and now i'm going to save this file in the popgen file formats i'm going to save in your current working directory i'm going to save this file and give specific name of according to your uh, analysis these are the co-dominant Co, co dominant haploid haploid alpha alphabetic data that's it so now i'm going to save this file in our current working directory save i'm going to minimize this one and load this file as a load data it's co dominant data file format i'm going to load the co dominant haploid alpha right now i'm going to open ok 
now file is open in the PUBG software now we are going to analyze this using the code dominant is a haploid data analysis now once open the haploid data analysis window then select your variable as a column and types of population you are going to analyze these are the multi population total number of five population present in our data and what type of analysis you want to do in the select all if you're not sure which analysis you are want to do so i am selected uh, multi population and all analysis to locus ld and now going to click on ok and new window will open there is a some mistakes who will be there uh, should enter the line number population number see here i have to mention remember that you have to mention correct spelling and the number of populations here i am missing here here is a s l l l s the mistake is there spelling so i am going to change this uh, see here i am going to delete s yes, population t i o now this will be okay now i am going to save this file again and then minimize this one and load once again this file see now your pop spelling is will be okay now you have to go to the code dominant haploid data analysis and just check all except this one you don't want click on that and click ok see if there will be resolve do you want to retain all loci for further analysis you have want to yes i want to take all loci in further analysis and do you want to retain all population for further analysis yes i want to take all population what is the significance of ld 0.05 it should be 0.05 or is equal to or less than 0.05 should be there and total number of uh, neutrality test simulation will be 500 2000 will be significant at 95 level 95 percentage then click ok then your analysis will be done a new window will open save all this information click on ok or go to file and save as this file as a result file in your uh, excel file uh, you are working directory current working directory i'm going to save this file uh, hold on App alpha result. Okay, click on OK. The file will be saved in the uh, your current working directory. This is a file alpha result. And this one also your result is there. So. And this is your tree if you want to see the tree you can use a mega software you can double click it and it's a directly direct uh, this file director uh, mega for your population dendrogram tree and you will get a different type of analysis as per your concern you see here is the population types population one and three is close two and four are close and five has a different population in this data file format this is all about Codominant haploid data analysis using alphabets. I hope you understand the haploid data analysis. Next video series, I will get hands on deployed numeric data analysis training. Don't forget to subscribe SciExpo, and you will find similar videos on the channel. Thanks for watching.